The main areas of research in the School of Dental Medicine are the, the Center for Craniofacial and Dental Genetics, uh, which really handles the, the genetic aspect of many craniofacial diseases, Center for Craniofacial Regeneration, which focuses on, uh, uh, on regeneration of various tissues like bone, teeth. The third area is in public health, um, and, and that focuses on um, the impact of, of pain or fissures, uh, how do you implement sealants um, on the oral health and also the social networks. Uh, and the fourth area is the dental registry, which is collecting patient samples for genetic analysis. These centers of excellence have, have developed a, a wonderful collegial collaborative efforts among uh, researchers and faculty within the dental school and also collaborations outside the dental school. If the Center for Craniofacial Regeneration, we have very strong ties and collaborations with the School of Engineering, with the School of Medicine. The NIH has a practice-based research network, a PBRN, which is dentists in their clinics, and they can sign up to engage in research projects. So even after you leave here, you graduate and you are a practicing dentist, if you would like to, you can, you can join the PBRN and still do research. And so the skills that you learn here can directly apply to that. Uh, you'll have an opportunity to know the basics about you know, how clinical research would work. You'll have the tools and you'll have a mentor to kind of train you in, in these uh, facilities. Once you graduate, you can take all these tools and go to your dental office and you can do uh, research there. And I think research, is, especially clinical research, is very important for you know, moving dentistry forward.